be good news, isn't it? Amazing to see those in the skies again here in the Absolutely. south. First time in 200 years. Alexis is here with the weather. A bit gloomy today. Not yes, what you want for summer. Yes, in some places, but others saw some sunshine. Let's take a look at that sunshine. Nick Warwick photographed the sunshine today in Henley on Thames. Catherine Jackson sent us this shot of raindrops on roses at Westmore's in Dorset. And Ian Nichols captured the sunny spells this evening at Hythe Marina. So we did see some sunshine eventually as we headed through the day, but we are going to see a lot of cloud overnight tonight with the arrival of some rain during the early hours of the morning. But we did see some gloomy conditions today. This was a scene at Clayton in West Sussex by Feifei, one of our weather watchers. We also saw some sunshine today. This was a scene at Denchworth in Oxfordshire. Oxfordshire saw the lion's share of the sunshine through the course of today. Tomorrow we are looking at some heavy thundery showers moving in, but also some sunshine at times. So it, it is a mixed picture. There will be really quite frequent showers during the day. Tonight some heavy persistent rain in some places, drifting north and westwards eastward sorry as it does so clearer skies will develop for western areas more cloud the further east you are and temperatures will drop away between 13 and 14 degrees so quite a mild night to come some of us will start the day with some sunshine others with a fair amount of cloud tomorrow morning that cloud creeping eastwards following it lots of sunshine but also some sharp and frequent showers those showers could be heavy enough to bring some hail and thunder in a few places but they will start to ease during the afternoon and temperatures will reach a high of 18 19 maybe 20 degrees but there will be a brisk southwesterly wind which will be stronger along coastal stretches maybe gusting up to around 35 miles per hour so for the coastal forecast tomorrow between selsey bill and lime regis the winds are west or southwest five or six occasionally seven at first decreasing four later and the sea state is occasionally rough so tomorrow night the showers will eventually ease we are going to see a ridge of high pressure building in so the skies will clear it's a, bit, a little bit cooler than tonight with temperatures still in double figures so lows of 10 to 13 degrees and still a fair breeze blowing through the course of thursday as we start the day there will be some sunshine for some on thursday more cloud for western areas creeping in ahead of this weather front which, it, which is expected to arrive later thursday thursday night into friday producing some patchy rain for some so east and areas having the best of the sunshine on Thursday. Friday could start on a fairly damp note in a few places, brightening up with showers later on and mainly dry for the weekend. Alan. Good news, Alexis. Thank you. Do join us tomorrow when we'll be talking blind football and catching up with a man from Waterlooville who says the sport has changed his life. He is about to take part in his biggest competition yet as part of the England team at the European Championships. That's here at 6.30 tomorrow. Don't forget we have our late news update at 10.25 here on BBC One. Thanks for your company tonight. Whatever you're up to this evening, have a good one. Bye for now. Good night.